Coach Kylie. Sea Lions are coming off a one nothing win over Westmont. Just give me a couple thoughts you have on today's game. Oh, it's such a treat to get to play Westmont. They're always a tough opponent, and today was no different. I thought they got the better hand of us in the first half. Um, I thought they dominated a lot of the first half, and I give a lot of credit to our girls for working through it. They work themselves through it, and it's good. We want to be tested right now. We want to learn and grow and get better, and I think we got better today, and we were tested today. Um, so excited to be back out here playing good opponents. Tell me about your senior, Ashley Watkins. She seemed to be very good for you guys out there, especially in the second half. Yeah, she's very active. Good for her to hit that finish. I mean, what a finish it was. Um, that's an area she's really grown in, grown in confidence in and ability in, and it's fun to see her get some, some fruit from that work. I do know you and a couple other members of your team do have some connections back to Westmont. Yeah. How was it playing, playing uh, Westmont today? You know, I feel like I've gotten that question a few times, wow. and... I feel like, honestly, at this point, we're just happy to have games. Um, and so it didn't really maybe sit with me so much until today, I think. It was just pure joy to see them and knowing that they were going to come ready to compete. Like, that's what we want. We want to be playing top teams, and Westmont is that. And so knowing that they're, they're going to come and compete is, makes it exciting. Well, Emma Thrapp was the one that, or sorry, not Emma Thrapp, Naomi Ellis assisted yep. on the goal. Last week, we got to see Courtney Kessler score. Just tell me a little about this new incoming class and what we've got to see out there oh, from this year. it's exciting. They're an exciting group. They bring a lot of talent and skill, and they also bring a lot of good energy and, and good mentality. And you see that from Nai. I mean, I, I think she's dominant defensively, and then love that she's getting involved um, in the attack in those ways. I think she has, she got an assist last week, an assist this week. We got a lot of young people doing a lot of really good things. Well, we do have to say next week you guys will be at home against Concordia and surprisingly that'll close out the home schedule for this year, but look forward to seeing you again next Wednesday. Thank yeah, you, Yeah, we're excited. Right. Thanks, Danny. Here today with Ashley Watkins and Emma Henson. Ashley scored the goal in the one nothing win out there against Westmont. Ashley, tell me a little bit about your goal. All right, well, so... <laughs> Now I had this nice cross off of Jass's slip through down the line and it just happened to come right to me honestly at the back post and I somehow slotted it in. I'm not really sure how that happened. <laughs> well tell me out there a little bit, Emma, you guys had another shutout victory. The defense progressed throughout the game and everything like that. Just tell me how that defense was and with so many new faces back there on the back line for you. Yeah, we definitely had to work into it at the beginning, but I feel like we really found our rhythm and we're still we're only on our second game playing together as a unit, so we're really just working on trying to find like how we play together and how we can get out of the back easy and just like what works, what doesn't work. And so I feel like we really found our rhythm towards the end and it's great we've got two freshmen playing back there, so just trying to get them in and together with all of us has been really fun. I know that obviously it's nice to put a W in the win column and everything like that, but is it important for you guys just this year is a year of growth? Is that what you guys are focusing on mostly? Yeah, I mean, we've all obviously been out of games for over a year, so I think it's just working back into the rhythm of games and finding the intensity every day through practice has been one of our goals, and just taking that and translating it into the game and just bringing the intensity every day and competing has been a really big theme for us so far. Well, you guys do have three matches the rest of the year. Um, next week, you guys will be home on Wednesday to close out the home schedule against Concordia. So thank you very much. I look forward to seeing you back here next week. Thank you. Thank you.